How exciting is this for you, given all you've worked and uh, and now final preparations? You're just a day before the big day. Yeah, definitely. I mean, it's a dream come true. It's something that I've been looking forward to my whole life, and you know, now that it's here, it's definitely special. And um, you know, I'm just counting down the hours. What was the year like for you uh, as as a individual on a team that uh, was working hard to get back and competing with so many tough teams in that Western Conference? Yeah, I think our, our, obviously our team struggled a little bit. I mean, we missed the playoffs, but um, it was a fun year and. You know, I think personally I had some success and, you know, uh, I played my game for the most part. And, um, you know, now I'm just looking forward to the draft. And next year you know, we, we're going to have a good team. So, uh, you know, hopefully we can uh, make a run at it. You come in uh, with quite a legacy beside you, behind you. We've got the Leafs here and around the corner, the Colorado Avalanche. And you think back to your dad's involvement uh, as a player. I, I'd assume you're speaking to Toronto, obviously. Have you had a chance to talk with Colorado? I talked to Colorado at the, at the combine, actually. And, uh, you know, it's definitely cool with my dad. You know, he was uh, played in probably five or six of the teams uh, here. So, um, you know, it's definitely special. He knows what it takes, and uh, he's taught me a lot. And, you know, um, you know, it's an exciting time for him, too. I mean, every parent wants their kid to succeed. And, um, you know, the NHL draft is just another step in the right direction. How hands-on did your dad have to be with you, bringing you up through the ranks? Um, I mean, I think when I, when I was young, he was hard on me. And, you know, he taught me how to be a leader and a player and, you know, how to work and, you know, how to have good habits. But I think now he's kind of, you know, let me go on my own and, you know, try to figure it out uh, by myself. You've made a name for yourself on the ice, but you've made an even bigger name on Twitter. And not just you, but your cat, Templeton James. Uh, tell us about this cat and the personality that uh, he brings to the game. Yeah, he's a good cat. That's that's not me. That's uh, my little sister, so I'm not involved in that. Uh, a lot of people ask me that, actually. It's kind of embarrassing, but, uh, yeah, that, that's not me. <laughs> good cat, though, right? Yeah, he's good. He looks like Garfield a little bit. <laughs>